People across the U.S. celebrated Veterans Day yesterday. For some students, it's just a day off from school. But as Coyote News' Byron Bonashek reports, for others, it's a time of remembering and thanking the men and women who have served this country. Last Wednesday, the Eagles Club hosted a Veterans Day dinner where veterans and their family and friends could gather together and be remembered for their time in the military. Attending the dinner were veterans ranging from the Vietnam War to the Gulf War all the way back to World War II. While attending the dinner, I had the chance to ask these veterans what makes the day so special to them. I guess uh, being in the service, uh, Veterans Day is a little bit more personal, kind of hits home. Uh, veterans are the reason I got into the service. Veterans that I started the National Guard. Veterans are the reason I'm going to want to be an officer one of these days. I want to go active duty in uh, the Army. And I guess veterans are the reason I'm doing what I'm doing. The oldest in attendance was Clayton Hal, a World War II vet that served in the Navy. He shares with us why he's grateful for this day. We survived, and here we are. I became a CPA, certified public accountant later in my life. Married a wonderful woman, have two wonderful daughters and a granddaughter. Life has been wonderful for me. Later I met up with Captain Jerry Zavesky, Assistant Professor of Military Science, to see what his thoughts about Veterans Day are. I get treated very well every day. Every day I go out, someone says, thank you for your service. Um, there have been several times that my wife and I, our meal was picked up by some anonymous person. In small towns, you seem to get it every day, and that's nice. For Coyote News, I'm Byron Banashik.